song that's playing for you is King Kong. So whether you feel like King Kong in your life, you feel like the dominant figure, you feel like you are back in control, or you just have, look, something's complete in your life, and now you are King Kong. You're back to being the wizard. You're back to being in control, like I was saying. <laughs> You are the gorilla in your reality. Everybody else are chimps. <laughs> Look, you fell in love with something. This was poking out, so I ain't gonna take it. But you may have fell in love with something. At one point, you may you may have been... People may have been confusing you or just playing you in regards to your emotions. Using your emotions to get the best of you, almost. But now it's like... You're, you may be defensive regarding your passions or it's like you, you know, you set up boundaries almost and that allowed you to put a burden down or that put you in the space to realize some burdens you had in, in your corner that you were unaware of. So now you're being in the defensive in regards to what is true to you and how you actually feel. You're not taking no more she hot from nobody. You know you found, you know you got a solid foundation. One 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 is what I just saw. You know you got a solid foundation, and you, whether that's you know you 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 got a solid mental state or and or solid third dimensional realm. You got you you know you got your crib. You got the web. You feel me? You got everything managed. You got you you got your money in order. You dig, or you just got a good good head on your shoulders. You gotta let let me know, or you got both. Cancer, no cancer, don't be tripping. If you know you be tripping sometimes, cancer, then hey, look, we all trip sometimes. But you know, look, you got a new perspective. You got some enlightenment regarding the situation. And look, now you may want to invest and or just exchange emotions or that this enlightenment puts you in the space to invest your time and energy into you. This could be you, your masculine and feminine and or someone outside of you or just a business idea or something that would, you feel would grow, take you to a higher level or a further state or a further space, a different space than the current space you are, That, but a, a different space that's better because of this enlightenment. Again, this is all speculation. Now, you don't have to let me know. 222 two, two is on the time. It's an advertisement, so you may be thinking, all right, we're about to pull a card, though. There you go. There you go. Uh, cancer. I was about to say Capricorn. You may be dealing with Capricorn. You don't gotta be though. What cancer got going on? First card. Yeah, what I told you. You healed your heart. Regard now if somebody said look 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 look. You healed your heart because you're chasing your happiness now. You feel me? You chasing your your freedom of expression, your whatever, yeah, and that's your justice, that's your balance. You, 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 king of coins right now, the king Kong, king of pentacles. How you expressing your mind and just you, 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 you're being free. You're not letting anyone's words or anyone's opinions or anyone's perspectives or viewpoints or just expression towards you fuck you up no more. You gave, like I said, one of the best of you. You giving something the best of you. You giving your life or just whatever you invest your time and energy into the best you got. Good on you. I think like last episode, you was giving motherfuckers back their bullshit. Good on you. No, somebody may be fucked up because you like this. Or you was the empress in reverse at once at one point in your life. You wasn't taking care of yourself the way you needed to take care of yourself or handling your business the way you needed to handle your business. So you just was just letting uh, fucked up people run your life and that fucked you up. I mean, that was when you were stealing from yourself or you were allowing people to take from you. You were just, and that father, look, based upon lies, based upon falsehood, you may be dealing with a cancer. You don't have to be dealing with another cancer. Cancer, look, time is one 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 though. <laughs> But, um, yeah, yeah, at one point you was letting people lie to you. You was just letting people do, express, and say any old thing. And it's like you would still invest your time and energy into that. But now it's like you cleaning house. You, 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 you know you got a standard. You got a bar. And if motherfuckers ain't up to that bar, or if motherfuckers don't meet you by what you, by like bare minimum certain requirements for you, you ain't fucking with it. I hope that made sense.
What song is this again? Yeah, best of me. Yeah, look, you opening up regarding your passions. It's like you healed your heart. You going for your balance. You ain't taking no bullshit from nobody. You ain't making no more poor investments or poor mentalities. You ain't building your mind off negative thoughts or negative frame of mind or just negative people, places, and things in your circle anymore. You cleaning house because you, you want your balance now. You know, in order to obtain balance, I got to be good as far as how I feel, how I internalize and how my heart is. And I got to open up regarding how I express myself and how I communicate with people and or just be true to who I am. Gain that enlightenment. Got an idea, got a new worldview, a new ideology to go by. You feel me? Some a switch flipped in you, and now you change. Again, at one point in your life, you may not have been been being true to who you are, or you were just letting people who aren't true to you guide you. But now you are cutting these people down with the truth in regards to how cancer feels. And that's stressing people out. Someone, if this is you versus someone outside of you, someone may want to open up and express themselves to you. And it's like they may be nervous or, and or anxious because they see you in the state. Look, what, I, what the fuck was I just saying? What was I just saying? Someone may want to express themselves to you, open up and express themselves to you, but they are anxious and nervous they they it's like they're overthinking because they want to make sure when they approach cancer they approach cancer in the right state look they they opening up regarding what they're passionate about which may be cancer but look they got the little band-aid on their head so they they a little wounded they may be a little hurt or if this is you this is you versus you 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 opening up regarding something that makes you feel you you want to make an emotional investment you look, I'm saying, you want to work on something. You want to open up and express yourself regarding something. But it's like you you may be trying to come up with an idea or you just can't stop thinking about something that you want to exchange feelings with. Whether it's a job, a person, place, or thing in your reality. You feel me? An idea, a routine you want to participate in. You want to open up regarding this, uh, whatever you're passionate about. You want to express this to your external realm. You feel me? Or if this is you versus someone outside of you, someone went outside of you wants to open up and engage with you. They see you in this healed state regarding communication and just self-expression. And now they want to work on something with you, but they may be overthinking that shit. They're trying to come up with an idea on how to make sure when they take this step or take this action, they take this action the right way. Feel me? You don't have to let me know, though. I'm going to fuck with you. What song is this? We paid. Someone that's playing for you. Go ahead and get your messages from that. You damn. <laughs> I'm gonna fuck with you. <laughs>